Uh, 55 and 44, uh, Chris Harris to get back in on the act. Back with the leaders, they come around the chicane for the penultimate time. Next time they come over the start-finish line, it'll be the chequered flag that they'll be looking forward to seeing. It's Nick Swift who's retaken the lead ahead of Nick Padmore. Padmore, though, did, uh, did a great lap, but Swift did an even better lap, particularly in the latter section yeah, of the 2.4 miles. Gets of the other way, from 0.3 to 0.4, a three deficit to 0.4 advantage for Swift. Lewis a long way back in third, but very safe. Look at Padmore. Padmore's poised in the slipstream. Popping out of the slipstream on the inside of three goes. Yes, he has. Just two wheels on the curb, but he's through on the inside. Can he hold the line? Almost certainly he can because he's on the inside. He's got the racing line. Nick Swift is now going to do it all again. Halfway round the last lap. Toby, is there anything left for him? Well, it's going to be down towards Woodcote Corner. Slightly different lines between the pair of them, but Padmore has certainly pulled the pin now. And that was at Fordwater. That was a dramatic move, middle of Fordwater, that got him ahead. It was. It was a good move. Now, but here's Swift inching up very wily into the slipstream. Is that too far, though? Is that too far it away to, by the catch, time to get the woodcut? To catch the draft. He's got it now. He's getting ever closer. Padmore's going to push him right. There's going to be running out of road. He's going to push him right. And it's going to be too tight a corner. He's going to go for it. Nick Swift on the inside with the green car. Nick Padmore going to be pushed out onto the outside. Wonderful. Who's going to keep the momentum down to the chicane? Nick Swift is looking. Padmore can't get through into the chicane. Nick Swift on the last corner takes the victory in heat two of the Betty Richmond Trophy. He's got his hand out the window already. He's almost giving them high fives before he crosses the line. He kept the best till last against Nick Padmore. What a manoeuvre.